Hey, what's up, YouTube? Gemini Jets 1272 coming at you guys with another model airport update. This is for Chicago's O'Hare International Airport. So, um, a couple things I want to say before I get started is that the Q and A video, or why I answer you, where I answer you guys' questions, will be on Sunday, February sixth, or a week from today. So you have a week to submit questions, and I will answer them then. Second thing I want to say is that this was actually the first actual airport I did. So I'll, I'm going to leave the link a link in the description for um, the video, the first airport update I did, which was this airport, uh, which was Chicago O'Hare Airport. So you can see exactly what has changed in my airport updates and how I did them since then. Well, anyway, guys, anyways, guys, sorry about the background noise. Once again, there's people upstairs. I don't know why. Every they're so quiet. They're quiet when I'm down. When I come down here, and then when I actually start the video, they're really loud. So, all right. Let's just start it over with the carpet section. All right, right here we have a UPS 767-300. The air stairs just pulled away from the aircraft. He'll be pushing back shortly for Philadelphia. Emirates 222LR. He's getting catered for Dubai. Two tug spark right there. Um, this is actually pretty good. This is this isn't really the way I usually do my airports. Technically, American and De and United would be over here, but I put them in the international terminal instead and move the internationals over here. So, But it's kind of hard because they're all wide bodies and you can't, or most of them are wide bodies and you can't fit wide bodies in these narrow bodies gates. So, Okay, Lufthansa A340-300, he's getting catered for Munich. Westjet 737-800, he's getting cargo loaded up for Cal Calgary. Yep, someone's not happy upstairs. Okay. KLM A330-300, he is getting um, pilots and crew on, members on board. He will be making a flight out to Amsterdam Schiphol in a couple hours. Just push back. We have a Delta Airlines 737-800. 800, yep, that's an 800. He will be taxing over to 27 for a, a non-stop service to Atlanta at Hartsfield-Jackson. Next at gate, we have a Alaska 737-700. He will be making non-stop service to Seattle, Tacoma. And right here, getting luggage on board and people on board. We have Delta MD-90. He will be making a flight out to Detroit today. Okay, let's take care of... This is the American and United Terminal, since they both have hubs here. Let's start off with United. All right. Right here, we have United Airlines, Boeing 767-300ER. He will be making non-stop service to... Hold on, no, wait, never mind. To Cancun, Mexico today. All right, Delta Airlines, I mean, not Delta. United Airlines, Airbus A320. In the stars and bars, sorry guys, I should have checked these gates before I got started. He is getting luggage on board in the back. He'll be making a flight out to Austin, Texas. All right, sorry guys, I should, really should have checked check these gates. All right, here just pushing back, uh, just pulling in the gate. We have a United Airlines A three twenty Star Alliance. He's just pulling in from Omaha, Nebraska. And then right here, getting fueled, fueled up. We have a United seven fifty seven three hundred. He'll be making a flight to Honolulu, Hawaii. Let's go to the American side. All right, American Sim 200 in the old colors. He's getting fueled up for Miami today. And then those that got, all got mixed up. Oh, well. All right. Okay. Just getting... That doesn't look very good, but anyway... Just getting luggage on board, we have an American Airlines 737-800. He'll be flying to West Palm Beach, Florida. And then right here, we have an American Airlines A319. He'll be flying to Boston, Logan. All right, here, getting passengers on board in the hard stand gate. We have a Delta 717. He'll be flying to... If I can find him... 
he is going to Minneapolis St. Paul. So a little short flight for him. All right, let's start with the taxiways. Let's see. Yeah, let's start right here. All right, United A320. I mean, United A319, which will be taking off momentar momentarily for. New Orleans, Louisiana. All right, FedEx MB1030. He's just taxing over to 34, I think. And that is, it's either 40, 34 or 48. I don't know where it's going. All right, wait. All right, he'll be taxing over to 34 left for a flight out to Pittsburgh. Sorry, the way I do my airports that I have to figure out where they're going so I can tell you guys which end, end of the runway they're heading to. All right. We're just pulling off the runway. We have a Delta Airlines 737-900. C.E. Woolman. He just came in from Salt Lake City and will go over to the Delta side of the term terminal. They're taxiing from the American Gates. A very long taxi. We have an American Eagle E-175. He's going over to, to 27 for a flight to Des Moines, Iowa. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, I have slides on down here because even though it's like 55 degrees outside, it's pretty cool down here. All right, here just holding short of 34, we have a Delta Airlines 767-300ER. He will be, after the A330 lands, he will be making a flight out to Paris Charles de Gaulle. That's a seasonal route. And then here we have a Delta 737-A3. 30-200 actually coming in a little, little, the nose is up pretty high, but anyway, that's just because of the stand. All right, he is just coming in from Paris Charles de Gaulle as a seasonal service, but he's coming in, and then that's what I'm just going to say for this airport, because I wanted to put all my Deltas in because they're my biggest carrier, and this airport would look nothing like Chicago if I didn't have my Delta, these two in, or if I didn't even have one in. So this one just came in, and then this one will, will just be heading out. So yeah. Alright guys, that's it for this airport update for Chicago O'Hare International Airport. Once again, I will leave the link of my first airport update, which was of Chicago O'Hare, in the description so you guys can see what has changed in my updates and how I do them. And, yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Please give us a like, comment, and subscribe. And my next video will probably be on Tuesday. Probably a model review. Thank you guys.